Hey everybody, welcome to another Age of Grogu, and we have with us Elijah, Max, and Jason, and tonight we're going to be looking at episode 5 of Loki, season 2. Uh, last week was a banger, we we got the all rebooted the universe. <laughs> yeah. So far, the, every yeah. episode has yeah. been bangers. Yeah. And I'm Max, just happy that I'm... Been, I've, I've, been so, so much I'm bangers just... that they've had MASH with it. I'm just happy that like uh, I've convinced Brent to start using that term bangers. Ba no, Bang, you yeah. you haven't convinced me. I don't even know where it came from. Maybe it's just subconscious. It came from I don't me because I've been saying it like oh, every really? week. Yeah, I, I completely. You know me. I don't listen to you. <laughs> anyway, he listens to me subconsciously. Sometimes, some subconsciously. Yeah, it finally drove into. Banger, you're gonna call it banger ring. So, guys, we've 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 had this whole reboot of the universe at the end of last week. So, uh, what are we gonna see? Is this is this gonna be the final week that we see, um, 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 uh, like the jet ski? Is it gonna be an entire episode just on jet skis? I don't know. Oh, just jet ski the whole time. I don't know. I don't no, think we're gonna get hit a jet ski at some point. We got two yeah, he still has to, doesn't he? Yeah, he has to. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I mean, I'm I. I have no clue where this is going. Uh, I don't Neither think any of us do. That's what we yeah. all love. I mean, it's great yeah. that we don't know where it's going and have no no guesses, you know? Yeah. And yeah. with that, guys, let's do this. Ready for it? We're going to do this on three, two, and one. Oh, You're man, we have yeah. no idea. We have to pick up after this. Yeah. Pure annihilation. Well, what? The rebooting of the Universal starts with Marvel Studios. Oh, it is white! <laughs> oh my god! Wow! That's a white hot room. Nice. Oh, he's just like he plugged into the Matrix, dude. Oh god. I'm so Who? Ready. The birth of the universe. Oh, maybe. Oh, that wasn't so bad. Eyes? Oh. Huh. Oh, he's like, doesn't know where he's at. He's like, what happened? Oh. <laughs> he only survived because he's Asgardian or <laughs> something. No, oh, everything no, looks like it's cool. Look, it's all working. It's all good. Oh, look at the strands. Yeah, they're kind of like reassembling themselves. On the yeah. End. Oh, that was a weird edit. I know. Is this uh, oh. the oh, shining? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're doing. Oh, this is cool. I like this. The uh, yeah. Kubrickian. Yeah, yeah. That was awesome. <laughs> Disorienting. It's cool. I like that. Ooh, he's time Ooh. Oh. Hello. Loki no. yet? No. no. Yeah. I think it's he's in different time frames in the same. Oh, whoa! Shit. Oh, that's uh. Oh, that looks crazy. That's so spun out. Ah, uh, I'm missing it. I'm missing this. Oh, right now. Whoa! Escape from Alcatraz. Oh yeah, that is. Oh what? Oh, it's Casey. Whoa. Huh? Are we seeing where they're coming from? Dang, Casey's a convict. <laughs> Interesting. Shawshank Redemption oh, era convict. Weird. That's cool. There's yeah, we see each character right and how they get into the TVA. That would be that awesome. could be fun. Awesome. Oh, we Whoa, also thought... this is totally like Escape from Alcatraz. We all thought Casey huh. was a nerd. Yeah, <laughs> it's nothing more manly than Jailbreak. <laughs> well, this explains what happened because they could never found the guys who escaped from Alcatraz. So maybe they like float into another dimension it is alcatraz oh it is too yeah, oh shit yeah. that's oh, funny wow. yeah no it totally wow. is it totally is yeah oh that's funny integration of real history i love yeah. it oh go dang he's nope. jumping through time and space now dang whoa whoa <laughs> oh man be fun. <gasps> 2012. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. That's like this MCU's 9/11. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was just about to, yeah, about to say everything's about to go horribly wrong, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh yes. What? Is, is what? a jet ski like... salesman? Oh! No. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ready for your so he's only recently been pulled out. I'm good. Well, That's time weird. works well, we differently. Really they all got pulled out of it. Yeah. <laughs> but they... It's non-linear. It's yeah. non-linear, Brent. It's no, I, don't, I, I get it, but it was like, I'm just amazed how <laughs> recent <laughs> it is. <laughs> That's funny. Whoa, whoa. Pr Piranha. He's doing spots. the dance. Oh. 
<laughs> oh. oh, look at that. Whoa, he's wow. on the Oh, that's crazy. It's going to be a time loop. Loki's going to recruit everyone? <laughs> I think so, yeah. That's a nice spot, dude. It's like a hangar. Oh, my yeah. God. <laughs> I love their logic. Excellent. Yeah. It's just don't think about isms, but in a much better way. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he's the man of Vitruvius. Yeah. No, that's what Spider Man did in Spider Man 3. I think this is the problem with multiverses. There's so much explanation and expository nonsense. To make it work, you, know, you got you know, some way of explaining it. It's like watching Inception. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ah, nice. Oh, show him the picture. <laughs> you give him a copy of that. What if he had that knowledge? Ooh, <laughs> Wait, do you think his wife got snapped out? I'm afraid. Because this would be during the snap, right? Oh, well, that's possible. He's a single dad. Could be. <laughs> oh. Oh, he's oh. oh, look at that. Nice. I promise you this will make sense. Temp pad 1.0. <laughs> oh. Get him some lemon meringue. I love that the whole TVA is kind of based off of his workshop, of Obi's workshop. Yeah, yeah just work off of like, that aesthetic. <laughs> yeah. As... Doesn't he live in like Southern California? Or they said uh, San Francisco That's, around that Pas area. Yeah. Pasadena. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Pasadena. Pasadena. How does he afford a building this big in Pasadena? If it's, the a nine, it's the 90s. <laughs> Why does it answer that? <laughs> 93. He worked, he's a professor at Caltech. Still, look at this building. And that, it's an Eagle Rock, it's not in Pasadena. <laughs> <laughs> Sylvie. Oh, she's in, of course, 1982, McDonald's. <laughs> Technically, you can go back in time and, or you can just go up to Asgard and visit Thor right now. What the hell? Oh! Oh shit! Uh -oh. oh shit! Oh! Nope, this world's collapsing. It's pretty spun out. Well, this is what happens when you listen to the Velvet Underground. <laughs> <laughs> this happens to <laughs> Lou Reed's fault. Yeah. <laughs> the magic of Lou Reed. Our oh, world's gone. Yep. Yep. How can they still be in here then? Because it's not their world. She was in her world. Yeah, she's in a branch. Yeah. It just collapsed. Oh, oh, okay. okay. I think they were actually all in different branches. That makes mm. sense. That makes sense. Yeah. Ah, oh, damn it, Casey. Oh, no. Hey. Oh, wait. I didn't take it. No. Oh. Things started disappearing. Things are disappearing in this planet too. In this. Yep. Here we oh. go. Oh shit! Oh. 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 Too late. Mm. So far, MCU. Three different ways we've seen people disappear. Yeah. Oh shit! So that means yeah. it's all leading to a reboot. Uh huh. Oh, did he learn how to no do it? Learn how to control Aww. his time hopping. Huh. It's not about where, when, or why. It's about who. It's about who. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Call it. That makes complete sense. I can rewrite the story. Oh, nice. Shit. Oh. <laughs> huh. Wow. Glorious purpose, huh? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> is there a... Uh, a Man, season? these are so good. Oh, yeah. These, that the, was uh, crazy. Season, Loki season two is better than season one. These are, are so yeah. great. Now, there's no, no end credit scene. Man. Yeah. That, that was awesome. We got something entirely different this week. It was it was great. It was... I, know, yeah. I like how we know where they all come wow. from now. Yeah. Wow, that was great. No, I was, was a little cool. off from you guys. That was a little annoying, but 
because you guys yeah. were acting like three seconds before. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Man, but we had like a, more than half of the hair flips in the whole season happened in this episode. <laughs> yeah, it was like too much. Too much was going on to focus on hair flips. Yeah. So as fabric of time is falling apart, it still doesn't yet tell us what happened to uh, he or you know. Who right. Else. Yeah, we know, we know so we don't, about that. Yeah, but but he was the first to fall apart in that formation, so it's got to have something connected with the strands of everything. Also, they but, didn't even look for him. I thought that was weird. No. They didn't even, yeah, there he was in the room technically. They yeah, I guess. Find, yeah, they didn't even try to see if there's an uh, yeah. alternate. To him. Well, but 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 Loki was automatically pulled towards everybody specifically. Um, so he would have been pulled towards he who remained if he existed in that oh, form in that in that world. So we don't know about that story yet. I guess we'll find out next week on the season finale. But uh, yeah, yeah. Don't end. I was Man, this is so going. exciting. I yeah, no, I just I, I I'm still at this point. I don't know where this show is going. I don't know where it's about to you know where next week will take us and how that's gonna necessarily tie up or finish up the you know the story will there be a season three i mean i think it's gonna wrap up into uh probably another big reveal showing what's going forward i think a lot of it seemed to be teasing from the idea of reboots sure uh, you're right i I think you know this could be the thing that leads to the reboot of the mcu um that would be interesting yeah Oh, they've got that option because of all the problems that are going on right now uh, with with just the lack of audience interest and participation with with you know Jonathan Majors is you know we don't know where that's going to go in the you know in the next month and everything but there is the chance from this one story arc that they can do a reboot and totally reshape everything uh, the way they want to reshape it you know yeah. so you're right. And change things that might be on the drawing board right now that might be still moving forward and go, listen, this is not going to work where, you know, they've already said that they are going to try case, to. Yeah. If that's the case, this has been their plan since like last year then, I guess? Or? It's a possibility. Well, I saw an interesting but... theory saying the idea behind a lot of this stuff could be to uh, that the reason why there's only ever Avengers in this world is that Kang went back in time and killed the Fantastic Four and right. Charles yeah. Xavier and made it so there was no other super teams, but he still couldn't oh, stop the. Uh, oh, that's Avengers interesting. That, you know, that makes oh, like that. That'd be, that, that, that would that'd be, be awesome. wicked. That that would be I wicked. like that. Yeah, <laughs> I like that. Yeah, I saw that theory. I thought that was pretty solid. That's actually it's, a yeah. pretty solid that theory. Explains I mean, it's, a lot yeah. of stuff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not a, whatever. It just works. That works like mm-hmm. story wise for Marvel. Yeah. And, like I could see that totally working. Totally. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I like that. He's got rid of Fantastic Four and X Men. Yeah, that's good stuff. It gives a reason why they don't exist, and so we've been yeah. watching this weird universe. Yeah, yeah. Well, forever. mutants, mutants <laughs> only just kind of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's oh, that's, that's interesting. Cool, man. Yeah. That's we that's could do a whole new good. age, just the Marvel age, and just throw everything that they have at the uh, sure. at the wall and see what sticks. Yeah. I mean, I'd be down for that. I mean, this this series is revitalizing me a little bit. I'm hoping that you know, Miss Marvel uh, next, uh, sorry, the Marvels next week uh, when it drops has got the same impact. Uh, actually, this is going to be interesting because yeah, we'll be we'll be literally getting the Marvels at the same time as the as movie the comes finale. out, the season finale of Loki. I don't know if they're going to tie into each other. I don't. I, d- I doubt there's going to be any tie-in. There doesn't appear to be any tie-in, but at the same time, it's like. Okay, it doesn't mean that that film couldn't happen at an earlier point in time as well. I mean, yeah, we've, we've been given stories out of out of time and out of out of alignment, uh, you know, yeah. to, to suit their purpose. But I'd be fine if this was a fixed point in time that kind of gave them the, the permission to go out there and and do something really different. Uh, from what they may have already planned on the table that may not be working at this point in time. And there's obviously, there's a lot of stuff that's not working at this point in time uh, for the last couple of years. So hopefully they will take that into account. Uh, yeah. We'll see. I guess we'll see. I mean, we won't know it until we start getting, you know, at least for another year or two, once they've kind of gone through their DC universe moment of 
getting rid of the old and moving into a new. But they've got that option. They've I don't think option. they'll ever have that DC Universe moment. The oh, no, 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 no. But, but, but it, it, they still have stories that are, on the t- that are already shot and done and in the can, you know, whether it's TV or movies that are, you know, ready to put out there. Uh, they've yeah. been shot or halfway been through sh- shot so hopefully that stuff can be melded a little tighter to what's going on with Loki because I'm fascinated in this story it's it's really pulling me in mm-hmm. and it's and a, I, it's allowed like you know because of the whole premise of this mm-hmm. of the Loki series yeah. it doesn't really need to be tied to much right it could exist outside of anything that's happening yeah. yeah but but just to see the strands reconnect in a different way next week yeah. That that could form the entire mutant race in existence again, and and this is this know. is the this is the curse that every Marvel show has sure. is this type of assumptions on like everything being tied. Unfortunately, you're right. Yeah, that's it. That and they that don't. was a little too big, and now we're yeah. getting one strand next week to be like bub 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 like, and popping still just It would be it would be it's cool. Just but... our own show. We've been so spoiled. You're right. From, like, yeah. Yeah. Right, like previous Marvel yeah. Universe stuff that we're but, just like waiting for that connective tissue. But but no, leading that spoiled. That was the heart of Marvel Comics was these heroes yeah. having interactions with with each other. But but leading mm-hmm. into this s- season two, and knowing what has been going on the last year or two, that you are losing your audience. What a creative way that they could sit there, three months, you know, four months, six months earlier. And go, you know what? This is the point in time that we might be able to wow our audience and and kind of do that and drop a ball that we could only guess. Who knows? But then again, we might just get a we might just get a season finale and then yeah. everything goes back to normal, <laughs> which is probably going to be the case. But it would be cool to see them drop this ball on us yeah. that allows us to be. Like change to, things like yeah things yeah change things and and bring up the thing of we are going to get the fantastic four we know that yeah. but why are we going to get the fantastic four this this would be cool to see a moment in pivot time of the mcu storytelling mm-hmm. to say this is how That's, we're going to get that now that would be really cool um yeah. it's interesting you say that it was just a moment in time where um a reed richards variant destroyed the uh the world and then now, he basically did it by taking all the other Avengers out of, you know, and stu- superheroes yeah. away. He took their powers before they could get them. Like, he's killed the Fantastic Four in the experiment and made just yeah, that, land. He, yeah, maybe. he um, killed the, the bug that can squash Spider-Man. But I think it could be an interesting mm. way to go about it next week and kind of show yeah. why Kang is a bad guy. Yeah, we need to see that. We seriously, if Kang's mm. going to be the big super bad, then we need to understand why that, because... He's died three times now. At this That's point. what I'm saying. Like, he's died three times. The three times I've seen him, he's died every time, and he dies a wit. You know, like he he goes. He's out. never had a cool death with a, like a sword yeah. fight or like. And where he, he really goes down. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Know. And guns blazing means doing hey, some real harm gotta, to others. And you gotta he give him some puppy by that man. You gotta you gotta <laughs> give him some credit though. Like all other bad guys have died only once. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's 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 the Kenny of the MCU. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he just keeps coming back. You know? just keep... <laughs> it's always just a version of yeah. him that comes back. Yep, that. Totally. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching our reaction. Uh, we are going to be excited to see the season finale next week and see what goes on. Um, and uh, we'll obviously be talking about this on on the podcast on on Sunday. So if you get the chance, join us then. Uh, yeah, so thanks. Please like and subscribe if you have not already. And we shall be reacting to episode six next week.